How do you deal with conflict to achieve a win-win outcome? Hi, I'm Darren Stevenson, Managing Director of Extend After School Care. Even the most harmonious workplaces, teams or communities will experience conflict simply because we are all individual people. Conflict pioneers Kenneth Thomas and Ralph Kilman have identified five different styles of conflict management. Competing, collaborating, compromising, avoiding and accommodating. You can read more about this on our blog post linked to the description box below. For now, let's talk about the collaborative style of conflict management. A collaborative style is valued in many business situations and we can take specific steps to practice this. First and foremost, we need to learn how to listen. One of the hardest things to do when you're faced with conflict is to actually listen to the other party. While the other person is putting across their point, we're usually busy coming up with our counter-argument to retain our point of view. If you really want to listen, you can break this down into four parts. Aim to understand the point of view of others. Resist the urge to interrupt. Ask questions and paraphrase to ensure you understand. Secondly, adopt a can-do approach. In your mind, you may have already developed a resistance to the other party's point of view or idea. Turn this around by focusing more on what can be done rather than what can't be done. Be honest, but focus on the delivery of the message and aim to be constructive. So, rather than saying something like, your idea is silly and is never going to work, you could say, I understand and agree with the outcome you're trying to achieve, so let's explore a few options to find the right solution. While it's important to be honest, it should never get personal. Focus on the outcome, look from the broader perspective and find the common ground. Keep it professional and no one gets hurt. While conflict can be unpleasant, it can offer opportunity to learn and can lead to a win-win outcome for everyone involved. Have a go at following these steps to see if it works for you. If you found this video useful and want to learn more about conflict management, check out our blog post which is linked to the description bar below. Don't forget to share this with your colleagues and friends via Twitter, Facebook and email. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.